So HPV is a girl thing, right? Nope, HPV does not discriminate. And HPV throat cancer affects more men than women. In the US, HPV throat cancer is the number one HPV cancer, surpassing incidence of cervical cancer. I heard about this vaccine for HPV, but I thought it was just for girls. The vaccine is recommended for both males and females. HPV is the most common sexually transmitted virus. The CDC says virtually everyone will get HPV at some point in their lives. Isn't this a young person's disease? I'm old, can I still get it? HPV is a virus that you can contract at any time in your life, usually through intimate contact. So how do I know if I have HPV? Ask your gynecologist for an HPV test. Remember, a positive HPV test is not cancer. Currently, there is no approved test for HPV in males, but there is a vaccine for HPV that helps prevent infection and certain cancers. How does HPV turn into cancer? HPV can cause six types of cancer. Most people's immune system clears the virus within two years, but for some people, the virus can linger in the body for decades and turn into cancer later in life. I heard the vaccine was for kids. If I'm in my 40s, am I too old to get vaccinated? No, the recommended age is now up to 45. People can get different strains of HPV over time. If you're unvaccinated, you can still acquire higher risk strains later. Ask your doctor to discuss the benefits of vaccination. Learn about HPV and cancer prevention for your kids, for yourself. Please visit us online to learn more.